Happy Friday, gang. We got an Iman by five minutes to get warm with, so we are starting 30 second cardio and then going into, for the rest of the minutes, 45 seconds of work, and then you'll have 15 seconds of transition time. So, we got kneeling push-ups, bicycle crunches, press up, or some people like to call it a cobra hold, and then up downs. So, cardio choices, we got jump jacks. You can go high knees, or you can go mountain climbers, guys. Also feel free to run outside, do jump rope, something along those lines. We just want to get a heart rate up. Then you got 45 seconds of kneeling push-ups. So we want y'all to just go modified. We want you to just get warm. So onto our knees and then still keeping good push-ups. Notice where his hands are, guys. His hands are by his chest, if not like a little bit lower. We see a lot of people with hands really high and then they shrug up and that is not good for us. We don't want to shrug up in this position. Then you'll flip it on over for bicycle crunches. So good hollow position. And right there, he's keeping his heels off the ground. He's pulling his core down to the ground and bringing opposite elbow to opposite knee right there, fully extending that other leg. Then 45 seconds of a press up or cobra hold. It's the same thing, but you want your hands down by your side as much as you can and bringing chest up. Notice again, he's not shrugging up, but he's pulling his shoulders down, his head's coming high, chest nice and tall. Get a good stretch through our core muscles and in our back as well. If this is super tight on your back, guys, like that's just painful, go to your elbows and do a similar thing. Shoulders down, chest up tall. Then lastly, we got up downs. So you can drop down into that push-up position right there. Make sure we're not letting our scaps come in at the bottom like a scap push-up, but we're keeping our shoulders engaged. Yeah, we don't want to see that. See a lot of people going like that. Don't want that. And that's a little exaggerated, but still. No curve in your back. No curve in uh, your thoracic spine, but keep good tension like a plank. Then for a workout, guys, we got an Iman by 25 minutes, and we got five movements, so you, got, you will have five rounds. So we're starting with 20 dumbbell ground to overhead. Then we got 15 strict sit-ups, 15 dumbbell tricep extensions, 10 hand release push-ups, and 40 jumping jacks. So we're starting with ground to overhead. So pull those shoulders back, and then we're being explosive with this, guys, going down to mid shin and then keeping it close to our body, popping our hips, and then punching bicep to ear right there. Boom. Then you hop down to the ground for 15 strict sit-ups. So with these guys, we're gonna have our arms crossed and we're not gonna use any momentum, but we're gonna sit up using our core, make sure we're sitting up tall at the top. Try to keep those heels on the ground, guys. And if you need to make it a little bit easier, extend those legs out a bit right there so really try to get 15 done in a minute and then we got 10 hand or no, no excuse me then we have 15 dumbbell tricep extensions so grab your dumbbell and we're going to stand on up with it we're going to hold by one end his hands are going to be on each side and then we're going to start with arms extended and then we're reaching that dumbbell back that dumbbell should almost touch our mid back and then we're fully extending overhead. He's trying to keep his elbows in the same spot and he's also not flaring his elbows out to the side. We wanna keep them kind of in a bit here, right there. Then we got our 10 hand release push-ups. So those triceps might be a little fiery at this point. So make sure we keep good form, modify as you need to, but going down release those hands out and then pressing straight up. Similar things as we were talking about the up downs earlier, we wanna make sure our thoracic spine isn't curving, isn't pinning in like this. That also causes our shoulders to shrug up, but instead we keep good tension right there, scooping our shoulder blades down into the socket right there and knock them out. If you find yourself even doing modified hand release and you can't keep good form, just go to regular modified. Lastly, we got 40 jump jacks. 
Just knock these out, guys. Knock them out, knock them out. Make sure we're not arching our back at all. You got jumping jacks. You got this workout. Go crush it.